like MBI, of all the programs I've seen that are focused on improving student behavior and improving school climate, it, it really is, is the most powerful um, at benefiting all students. Well, it's helped me a lot because I actually look towards school. I actually like have fun in school. Just having the focus on positive reinforcement of correct behavior has made a tremendous difference in, in the climate of our school. At Missoula County Public Schools, we believe all students can learn. Early intervention is the key to student success, and we must have a continuum of research-based interventions for students who struggle. Through MBI, we have developed a multi-tiered system of supports for our students. In Tier 1, all students are taught behavior expectations for the classroom, hallway, lunchroom, library, and playground. This helps students know what to expect and provides a predictable learning environment. Research tells us that reinforcing students for doing the right thing is more effective than punishing problem behavior. I equate Montana Behavioral Initiative, MBI, to time in class, and they relate very closely together. When kids um, are having problems or make wrong decisions on the playground or in the classroom or in the hallway, um, sometimes they were losing a lot of instructional time. And so with the advent of MBI in our building about six years ago, uh, we have found that those numbers have dropped dramatically as far as loss of instructional time. And when kids can be instructional in classroom learning, then that also helps with um, a lot of your other problems that you have. One thing that I notice is that we have way fewer discipline problems with, with MBI being implemented. We are down from last year. Last year we had an average of about 11 daily office referrals. This year, so far in the first quarter, we're down to under four office referrals. And that really speaks for itself. Um, the program does work when it's implemented correctly. You know, it just seems like the kids are here for um, a different purpose. You know, like they're here to learn and to be productive. We are working with some of the highest needs kids at Porter, um, kids with significant mental health issues, kids that need more support at home. And so MBI has really helped us identify those kids and develop systems to um, ensure that their needs are being met. And just not our kids, but um, kids that could eventually need higher level of care, but MBI is really helping us support them before their needs increase. So um, we've developed systems to be proactive and preventative. Like academics, for a variety of reasons, some students do not respond to primary prevention for their behavior and may need additional support. Through MBI, students who struggle behaviorally can immediately receive additional support through check-in and check-out, small group instruction, meaningful work, or mentoring. The few students with significant behavior or mental health problems are able to access Tier 3 services where they will receive a highly individualized intervention program that may consist of complex functional behavior assessment and behavior intervention plans, individual group and family therapy, and wraparound services. He's only been involved in the in and out program or check-in check-out program for about two weeks but already I've seen a huge change. Um, he initially um, sought the counselor out because he didn't want to attend school and now he does. The green tickets that they hand out for doing things that they are supposed to be doing, you know, being on task and doing things that sometimes are even above and beyond, they all come home and they usually have little notes written by their teachers saying thanks for helping me pick up in the hall or thanks for staying so focused. When I first came to Porter a couple years ago there was a punitive culture to a certain degree. Um, there was more focus on what kids did wrong instead of what kids did 
right. So rewarding kids for doing right encourages more kids to do the right thing. Uh, what I see in our high schools and middle schools and elementary schools is an effort to get along and to respect one another. And I attribute that to MBI and everything that it stands for. One of the things that we've decided is that we want every one of our schools uh, involved in MBI. Uh, that's kind of a non-negotiable this year that we want every school to work towards really solidifying their position on MBI as it relates to everything that we're doing in our school district. By the Green Tickets everybody wants to do something cool but also I've been thinking there's green tickets and cool stuff but even if there wasn't that people should still be nice. If you do something good then you may get something but it's not only about getting things, you should also just always do it, always do the right thing.